You either die Lima. or you live long enough to see yourself become the meme. Nicolo, a name that is synonymous with comedy, integrity, and creativity, am I right? You can watch the same songs. It's so funny and cool. But, but when someone is talking about guys simping for a girl, I just don't understand what's wrong with like worshiping a girl. There's nothing wrong with that, okay? Girls deserve to be worshipped. All right. Not saying specifically me. Okay? But girls should be worshipped. Alright? It doesn't mean you're a simp. Alright? Simping isn't bad. Simping is king sh Okay? My cat has taken bits that were funnier than Nicolo's ever been, honest to God. This poor thing. Yeah, she's not a poor thing. She's rich as all. Get up and go. Nicolo is a perfect example of how there is such a gender disparity in income online that it's ridiculous. You know how feminists always sit there and go, Ah, men make more money than women. Because they ignore the statistic that men put in more overtime at jobs than women do. Every chick I ever known, the second it was time for her to get off the shift, she was gone. She did not care. Meanwhile, my guy friends are like, oh, if I put in a little extra overtime. But point being, for an e-girl to get rich online, it's literally so easy because the bar is non-existent. The bar is on the ground. Let's put it in perspective. Nicola was a millionaire. <laughs> and the only thing she's done was the OK Boomer video. Now, I <laughs> defy you to tell me what else she's done besides that because I'm drawing a blank here, dude. Besides, like, go on Twitch and stream... Very boring ass streams where occasionally she says some sort of meme sh**. But Jeff Bezos is out there eating a thousand dollar steak in his trillion dollar mansion. And then what? What? What are you doing? What? Are, what are we doing? We're, we're here on on my stream eating a cup noodle. All right, we got it. We got it exactly. We got to eat the rich exactly. It's ironic. Till she got rich, you don't hear her talking about that no more. Talk about a paradigm shift. The girl was like, oh, tax the rich. Became a millionaire. Then she's like, oh, I think they meant tax billionaires. Uh, AOC, um, uh, shop. Okay, let's just keep looking at these, okay? So, is she getting eaten? She's worth a cool mill and is lining Jeff Bezos' pocket. Net worth of a million US dollars. Well then, looks up the exact thing we looked up. If you say so, tax the rich, so let's start with you. I had my stance on views in politics when I first put the first OK Boomer uh, TikTok. And even like whatever I'm making now compared to then, I would. It's definitely not something to like, I guess like rude about because there's nothing to be rude about. I think when people mean like tax the rich, uh, I think at the end of the day, they do mean like billionaires. And Lies! Lies! And people that have insane, unfathomable amounts of wealth. Listen, whoever wants to show me to where those one to five million dollars are, I would happily follow you and uh reclaim them because i have no idea where this money is, is at or where it's from <laughs> oh that's hot that's hot it's ridiculous point being nicolo's a millionaire for doing all one little dance and granted her whole career is premeditated and somehow she still popped off but anyway you slice it one dance look at the jake paul and logan paul in order for them to make millions, these two assholes literally have to grift and rig boxing matches. Anyway you slice it, Logan still took a direct hit from Mayweather to make a couple million. Nicolo, one dance! One! <laughs> the Paul brothers are rigging fights like it's 1930 and the mafia is still in power. Nicolo's just like... Time to celebrate the one year anniversary of me doing that thing people cared about. My God. If you ever need a proof that this girl doesn't need to try, look at how she does her makeup. She didn't even need makeup. That's how cute she was. Now she puts it on, but she puts on her makeup like an old lady. Nicolo looks like she takes makeup tips from my goddamn grandmother. 
What I'm saying is Nicolo doesn't know how to put on makeup. Because she's so attractive, she never needed to learn how to create a full face fantasy. This video is sponsored by Ridge Wallet, making sure that me being on the internet is somewhat profitable. Now I have two bags of packaged tuna. These wallets can hold up to 12 cards. They come in 30 different stylistic colors. I'm showing you burnt titanium and 18 karat gold because that's how large I'm living. I'm hood rich. These wallets have over 40,000 five star ratings. Bulletproof. RFID blocking technology. You could take a chainsaw to it. I don't know why you would, but the option's there. If it ever really, you know, like if you, your wife left you and you decided she wasn't even getting your Ridge wallet. Oh wait, no, it would survive the chainsaw. Forget that, sorry. Go to RidgeWallet.com slash It's a Gundam and use their unique promo code It's a Gundam to save 10% off of your order on your next purchase. Free worldwide shipping and returns if you don't like the wallet. Nicolo puts out a video where she's in her $2 million apartment in Texas, apparently. Okay. Now, the reason why this is a huge controversy, if you don't know, is because she's the okay boomer girl, and she was all about tax the rich till she became rich. And then if you watch her older videos, she just contradicts the living shit out of herself. It's absolutely wild, bruh. Frankly, I'm... I don't know why everybody's so mad. In the sense of, it's Nicola, and she's a cute girl. She doesn't seem that smart. It's nothing personal, but after watching one of her videos, you know, the lights are on, but nobody's home, if you know what I'm saying. Two, she's also a cute chick of reiterating this. How often has a cute chick said one thing and did another? Truth be told. And there's men out there sitting there going, Fucking right, man. <laughs> like, you talking about my ex-girlfriend, Gundam? And then there's probably women watching like, He's such a misogynist. But it's true. What did you expect from this girl? What do you expect from most of these socialists? And people who sit there, remember the BLM chick? Remember her? All against like the rich and whatnot? And then after BLM, all of a sudden she's rich and buys like a beautiful property far as from the ghetto. <laughs> like, come on now. Everybody who's a socialist is only a socialist till they're rich. This isn't news. Nikolov's videos are fucking terrible. Like, I sat and watched one entirely to prove a point about how she's pretty much a hypocrite, which we already know. But now I'm watching her $2 million home. Tax the rich! Moves to Texas so she doesn't pay income tax. I'm just pissed she beat me to it. If I could have a moment to be real, how does she get so much money? Like, can someone tell me? Because I don't know. I don't know what she's done besides okay, boomer, okay. Dude, there's one hit wonder rock bands that don't have the money she's got. Nicolo's got more money than Soldier Boy. That motherfucker's grifting emulators. Big Soldier. It's fancy, so um, we have our Nespresso over here. I actually don't drink coffee, but like, this is nice. You know, you've got the famous oven that I burn everything on. We've got this neat fridge that holds, that holds food. This is like Martha Stewart vibes, like, you know what's amazing? Nicolo's like, I love the kitchen almost as much as my office. What does she have an office for? Does she need an office to sit and figure out which new shit dance she's gonna do that won't be anywhere near as popular as the first one? I mean, let's remember, she did a tribute to herself. Some people poop, some people pee. So, a porcelain, a porcelain throne, one might say. So, this is our bed. Um, Nick and I, Take turns. Nick and, I, <laughs> Nick and I take turns um, sleeping on it. Of course, we would never sleep together on the same bed. That's that's a sin. But he has his man cave. That's what matters, right? Like. <sighs> okay, let's move on. Here we have a Snorlax. One of many Snorlaxes. All right, this is. The biggest Snorlax is... I'm not watching the rest of this, all right? Because it's absolute cancer. You watch a girl with the IQ of probably 70 show you around her million dollar apartment as you sit there and you wonder, A, how she got the money, B, 
Why didn't she just buy a house? Like here, I guess I can see the anger people have. All that time she spent screaming tax the rich and she runs off to a place where there's no income tax. <laughs> I'm fighting for equality. Oh, I'm rich now. I don't want to lose my monies. I earned my monies. I danced on TikTok. And basically, if you go on Twitter, you can see her on her very expensive BMW. I think it's that like electric BMW. It's gorgeous. It's got to be like a hundred thousand dollar car. And uh, yeah, there you go. Oh no, attractive girl turns out to be a hypocrite. What a shock. In 2021, women say things and do complete opposites. He hit me. I'm never going back to a man that treats me like that again. Week later, I'm back with him. I can't keep away. I'm going to stop drinking. Gets arrested for DWI evading the police. Meanwhile, my stupid ass doesn't do something funny. Every video people turn on me. Yeah, he was funny in 2016. He's played out now. All Niccolo has to do is post stupid shit and everybody acts like the girl is Oscar Wilde. I swear to God. It is the most ridiculous shit ever. Amazon drivers are modern day heroes avoiding multiple car crashes to next day deliver me my anime schoolgirl outfit. Yes. That poor Amazon driver. That poor piece of shit. Who literally has to make a certain number of deliveries in a time frame. Has to rush a multi-millionaire who's as talentless as my fucking cat. A goddamn outfit to wear on stream. Where men and boys with no self-respect for themselves as human beings. Throw money at her religiously and mindlessly. Then they follow her on Instagram where she writes shit like. Boobs are to be motorboarded. Happy 50 million views, okay, boomer girl. Get out, go away. Do you have anything else? My God. Even Chubby Checker tried to get away from the fucking twist. Oh, wow, Elgato is sponsoring her? <laughs> that shit has the least likes on her fucking page, 2K. Literally, the girl could write something like, you call them boobs, I call them pacifiers. 33,000 likes. She, if Oscar Wilde was alive today, he would probably commit suicide. Who's my little simp? I'm done. Vile con Dios, L.E. girl. Wait, no, no, no. Oh, I said it wrong. I didn't mean to say go with God. <laughs> like, as a dude, I have to constantly just be on point. And you can watch a girl who's not funny. Like, she tries to be cute and funny, and it comes off as cringy. You don't need talent if you have titties and a nice face. You just need to breathe oxygen. I'm sorry, I'm bitter. I had to watch entire videos of her. And it's just, it's like, I'd rather be in the ring with Mayweather. I know odds are I'd be gassed after round one and knocked out in the first three seconds of round two. But at least there'd be more money and less mental distress. Papa Snorlax, I would say. The king of Snorlaxes in this house um, out of three. You only see two today, though, because I ordered the other one and it's on its way. But yeah.